YouTubers, this is Zepify doing the next episode of Pokemon Sword Casual Nuzlocke. Um, I switched the team up a little bit, put Cerebral and Wiki in. A Wick. Just because I think that'll be a good uh, matchup against Ryan. Here it is, the last match of the finals. Who will earn the right to uh, challenge the unbeatable, uh, unbeatable challenge li champion Leon? Sorry, my voice weirdly there. Will it be the brilliant rising star challenger Kelly? Or will it be the only trainer that champion Leon calls his rival? The tamer of dragons, Ryan. Or Ryan. I don't know how you say his name, folks. You're really something else, kid. You made it all the way here. I guess that's why the champion himself endorsed you, yeah? Look at my rival, and he chose you. So I've got to, to first prove I'm better than you if I'm to beat him. I've reworked my whole team, and now we're all geared up for one and on battle. You might be thinking that you beat me once already, but... If you think I'm the same Ryan you faced during the gym challenge, you'll soon regret it. Sure, if you say, buddy. Gym leader Ryan. Oh, cool. Didn't expect to see that. Because it's a Torkoal, I think I might switch. Any problem is Drought, that's the only thing. I think Drought powers up Pokemon. That's Drought. It gets sunlight burning real harsh. Pokemon. Swap into Slick. Doesn't matter if you got Drought. Body press. Oh, I got squished. That was unexpected. Don't use hyper cannon. Don't want to accidentally kill myself. I'm leave myself wide open. Even though it's a powerful move, if I don't hit him and take him out the first time, then this is more than worrying than anything else. You're gonna hit, not gonna hit me with that. It's a two stage. Oh. I wasn't expected. Oh my god, that was close. I'm just gonna go for it. Oh, he's gonna full restore him. That's always fun. At least it's better than the alternative where he uses it on a Gigantamax. This time, go go away. Critical hit, nice. Thirty-nine, nice. Gudra, um, yeah, I'll switch. And again, get out of here. Unless he's got a fire attack, I'm pretty okay. I think Gudra's part war type, I think. I think that's right. Oh, it's got Sap Sip, but that's not good. Um, Not good, not good, not good. That's not good whatsoever. Uh, that's not good, not good. Got rid of the drought at least. Here it comes the rain. Your cold damp is soaked into your body. Look how his voice just keeps on changing. Um no, I guess I'll swap. Uh guess I'll send you Kinsey.
muddy water. Survive it, Kinsey. Yeah, you got good defense. Let's see. Try a crunch. That's gonna serve me. I just really wish it didn't have saps in it. It's more annoying than anything else. Well, that was a lot of damage. Just heal up while I think about it. At least I know I can damage it with dark type moves now. And he's already used his uh, hyper potion or whatever it was. So he can't use it again, I don't think. That's not going to kill me. I know I can survive it, so that's fine. Another crunch coming your way. Kinsey is amazing. Good and defensive. You may have started out weak, but you're not that weak anymore. Stop. Turtonator. Uh, switch Pokemon. He also put the slip and then immediately heal him. Please don't attack me straight up. For a second I thought he was just going to attack me and I was like, no, 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 no. Don't want to lose Slick. That would be a bad situation. Because he's like really good against what, uh, fire attacks. Forty bits. Dragon Pulse. Um, he's not too damaging. Nah, I can take another one of those. That's fine. Snipe shot. I won't use Hydro Cannon just in case he survives my first attack. Like that. Sunny day. I'm just glad I didn't use Shell Trap. That would have been so much worse. Wait, I'm not sure if Shell Trap activates unless... There you go, have a taste of the sunny day. I have a plan for you. Really, you have a plan. Oh, Shell Trap. Oh, that's worrying. But I think it only activates if I hit him with a physical attack. I think. I think that's right. Psychic. Uh, let's see. Side shock. Guess I'll get rid of side beam. Actually, I'll get rid of side shock. I think. Uh, actually, I'll get rid of Endeavor. I never use Endeavor, so important to keep it. Flygon. Um, yeah, I'll keep in. I think Flygon is like Dragon Ground type. It's not a shot. How many Pokemon does he have? I thought I'd really like killed four or five of them. Critical hits all the way. Nice. Sandstorm. That's not so good. Uh, that's a more of an annoying move than anything else. Cha, oh, let the winds blow straight forward, Sandstorm. It's more of an annoying move than anything else. It's just not nice. It just makes every other move seem boring in comparison. I mean, it makes every other move make it seem boring in comparison. I don't mean every other move. Oh, I'm just making weird. Uh, sentences now, which make no sense. I think I'm just a little bit tense, just because he's pretty tough for a trainer. Switch Pokemon. Um, an entire trick. I wish that Sandstorm wasn't on the field, that's just annoying. 
think the Raladon is still dragon. Do you realize I'm the right, right, great Rayon, right? You're the one to beat Leon, not you. Maybe great, but I'm greater. And you'll soon, soon come to understand that. <laughs> Jaw, bring the storm! My kit partner will sit in order the stadium flying. I don't know why his voice is going weird there. <laughs> Jaw! He just chucks it into oblivion. Still, still need to catch myself one of these guys as well. Just because. Let's. I, I ran into one before, but the thing is. I just don't think they like me. But at least I got rid of the sandstorm by racing with the sunlight. I like how his eyes are inside of his mouth. Yeah, this is what it's going about, probably. Remember it by. Even his Rotom looks sad for him. Joe Kelly sees a victory. My lovely Pokemon and I have become much stronger than we were before. But you just blew right past us, beyond anything I'd imagined. I'm still pretty young myself, but it just goes to show that there are always someone younger coming or up, reaching further than you ever dreamed. And you've got the whole future ahead of you. Keep up the momentum. Prove that Leon's not unbeatable. Number 12, Challenger Kelly has achieved a dazzling triumph. The trainer who was endorsed by the champion will now face the very man who endorsed her. This is the result of the final round. I'm getting super tense because I know... Champion's not going to be any pushover. Alright, the big moment's finally here, eh? I came just to cheer you on, you know. Still, it's not easy picking sides. After all, it's the showdown between my big brother and my rival. Who should I really want to win more? Real boom. Right, you reckon I should cheer for the Cali too, don't you? Couldn't agree more. After all, we did start this thing out together, way back in Postwick. So you better beat Lee, you hear? If anyone can beat the unbeatable champion, it'd be you, my mate. Rule boom. And there they go. Um. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna switch. I think I'll swap uh, Cerebral with Blair. Dark types, you know? 
I'm getting so nervous. Wait, so should I do that? Um, I feel like I should put a flying type on the team just to be careful. At the same time, I want to keep Blair on the team. smile of a champion. The, <clears throat> the tents still air is on the pitch. And the exact opposite from the audience, cheering and yelling. They're both fantastic, wouldn't you say? But remember, the audience is also a bit cruel. They want nothing more than to see one of us lose after all. It can fill you with fear knowing that, but absolutely love pushing past that fear. I do. I love giving it everything I've got as a trainer and seeing my team give everything they've got to seize another victory. It's the greatest feeling in the world and I can't get enough of it. I can feel my partners itching with anticipation inside their Pokeballs. We're gonna give a real champion time. I'm the Gala Region's champion, Leon, and I battle you. Me and my Charizard and all the rest of our team will I'll use all our knowledge and experience to crush you completely. Well, I didn't expect him to go brutal at the end of that. I thought he was going to say, like, Wait, hold on! Hey, look at the monitor! What is that on the big screen? What's going on? Hello there, Leon and Kelly. Let's just let you know. It's time I bought you on the darkest day for the sake of the gallery agent and future, of course. I'm in a bit of a pickle. The energy released by the darkest day is a little too much to contain. Something bad this way comes. I'm sorry to come to this, but if you force my hand, Leon, you refuse to listen. Wait, what comes this way? <laughs> I guess we're not battling then. We're running to find out what's going on. Lee, Kelly! That video stream, that was from Hammerlock Stadium, right? What in the world did the chairman do? I don't know. But everything he was saying yesterday, did he really pull that crazy stunt to prove some problem, solve a problem some thousand years ago in the future? Wait, what? To solve some problem a thousand years in the future? I've got to see what's going on. I'm the champion. I have to go. I should have realized what the chairman intended to do before it came to this. I'll take responsibility now for fixing this mess. This is the real champion time. I don't know why but I've made his voice like a lot more gritty. But Lee, these are terrible in directions. What if you're going to get lost along the way? I want to go help my brother, Kelly. I've got to. But I can't even m manage to beat you, so what sort of help could I be? You can help. Just try. But what What can I even do? Hold the phone. The chairman was talking about the darkest day. That's the thing where the sky went all dark once, ages and ages ago, right? What does he mean? He's bringing that about. Um, where did he even hear that name? The statue of the hero? The st that statue in the hero in Motorstoke. Sonia said something back then, didn't she? Though it turned out to be wrong since there were actually two heroes and all that. Still, those two managed to bring an end to the darkest day with the sword and shield Pokemon. Sonia thought that Pokemon 
those Pokemon might still be sleeping somewhere though, right? We should try to find them, Callie. But where do we start looking? Back in Slumbering Weald. That's it, Callie. I'm sure if we got to Slumbering Weald, it's got to be in Slumbering Weald, that illusion you tried to fight off that day, it must have been one of those, po one of the Pokemon that are supposed to be sleeping there. Let's go back to the Slumbering Weald. If we're lucky, we might find something we can that can help. Blah, blah, blah. I guess we're off to Slumbering Weald then. Hail the pitch, the winner's game, if you're ready. Oh, we just teleported, okay. Oh my god, it's you guys! Huh? Kelly and Hop? I completely forgot about the championship match. What are you two doing here? Oh, what was her voice again? Haven't you been watching the news at all? The tournament is off, Sonia. The chairman saw out to that and is sending the entire region to a state of havoc. Like, huh? Like what? What happened while I was researching... What happened while I was researching things in the slumbering world? Well, for starters, there's a great black storm and something raging over Hammerlock Stadium. What are they calling it? The darkest day? It's throwing everything into disarray. Rhyming is fun. Still, I'm sure we don't need to worry too much. I'll just give up my normal voice, it's fine. The Invisible Champion will be able to take care of everything, won't he? Like, hold on a tick, ma'am. Did you just say the darkest day? The darkest day is the name of the black storm that nearly brought the... Brought the... I mean, brought the Gala region and ruined to ancient times. So that's why you're here, Kelly. I'm here to search for the sword Pokemon. I suppose if the legends are true, then the sword and shield Pokemon should be able to prevent the darkest day from coming to pass. That may be just what we need to beat back that our that beat back that horrible dark black storm. He's so mean, you know. Okay, here, take this. You should head into Slumbering Wheels. I'll catch up to you with you once I'm done looking into something that have been bothering me. Uh, I don't use those, but thanks, I guess. Back where it all started. All that matters is that you do what you can to become a fine Pokemon trainer. After all. Ready for this, Callie? I wonder if we're about to head straight into the Wall of Fog again. Not that it bothers us now, we're both growing loads stronger. Um, so have our Pokemon. Going to the forest after Wooly that day. That was the start of everything, wasn't it? A legendary beginning, really. I reckon whatever we're about to see will be a pretty legendary itself. Let's head in and add another page to our tail. Uh, sure. Weakest Pokemon. Oh, I don't want to run into you. If you had been shiny, that would have been amazing, but you're not, so... Please, can you leave me alone? You don't squab it. Oh. There's one of you hiding in the grass as well. Why were you there? <laughs> you did not appear in front of my feet, did you? And with this, I say... Go away. that music again. That so reminds me of the first episode. It's like the beautifulest flute you've ever heard. 
think because I'm stronger it's not going to like attack me with the... Oh, hello. There's just a random glaring wheezing here. What is that? Oh, it's a Mooner. A wild Mooner. I'm not sure if I have one of you or not. I might have gotten you through Wonder Trade, I'm not sure. You'll soon show up if I have. Oh, I guess not. Um... I guess I'll catch you, just because... If you don't go in the first try though, if you're wondering why I have two Master Balls already, it's because when I was checking my Wonder Traded Pokemon, I mean, surprise for it, um, two of the Shinies I got run randomly had, like, Master Balls on them. I'm not sure why, <laughs> but that's the reason. I caught Muna, that was easy peasy. One new catch. I guess I already have one then. Oh well. I'll just check one more time what's in this grass. Is there anything new? No, it's just another Muna. Because sometimes um, the rare cat, the uh, rare mons in the route can be slightly different. So it's always a good idea to just check what you have. Oh, an item. Hello. Forest Storer. Must be this. Oh, it's just a glaring wheezing. Even though there are glaring wheezings basically walking around right now, they have to do one as the rare mod, that makes no sense. Neutralizing gas. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to go that way or this way, like, I saw two diverging paths, so. Uh, I guess I'll go rear first and see what's going on. Oh, there's a Pokeball. Mental Herb. Uh, an item to be held by a Pokemon. The holder shakes off blinding, binding moves. Move freely once it's used. Oh, I guess like that goes this way. Oh, it's just another move. I'm just trying to find something new. I guess it's just Moon is new. Either that or like... I don't know, they're the most common of the rare mons in the route. But I don't need to see you, so go away. Yeah, I'm gonna go this way. Oh, there's little bugs. There's a raven. Guess I'll check what this is. Oh, it's just another one of these. But I don't need you, I already have one. So I will just run away from you again. Because normally, um, oh, I wasn't looking at it directly. I, I, for some reason, I didn't see the Pokeball marker on it. Oh, what's up here? An elixir, that's always helpful. Try one more time. No, nope. I guess that's me not looking for Pokemon anymore. It's just Pokemon I've caught, and it's not fun to see things that I've already come into contact with. I want to find something new. But I guess I don't have a courtesy. Oh, what's that? Phantom Force. What does that do? The user vanishes somewhere, then strikes the. Wait, isn't Phantom Force like the move that Giratina has? Why is it randomly here? That's so random. Wait a sec, do I go on the water? No, I guess I can't go that way. I thought I was probably getting the water somewhere, but I guess not. Another item. Smoke ball. Don't need you anytime soon. Wait, what is that? Oh! There's a random stunfisk in the middle of this forest. And I haven't come across any stunfisk before. That was random. But I already have one of you, so I don't need you. Sorry to say. At least you're different than uh, two of the Pokemon I've run into most of the time in this route. Oh, that's hot. 
What's with this fog? It's even worse than the first time we came here. Oh, hello again. Wait, there's both of them here? Leord. Grilled. They look so beat up. They really are here. The sword and the shield Pokemon, I knew it. Wait, just hop get the shield. Oh, and there he goes. I guess they're gonna run farther in. Hey, where are you going? We need your help over here. You two, I don't know what are you doing? What? Come off sorry, you must have seen that right. The those those sword Pokemon and shield Pokemon, they were right in front of us. But then they disappeared into the forest. Hop, you sure you haven't lost your plot? There is no one here but the two of you. What? Then were those just illusions or something? Listen, I dug into some liter liter literature, bleh, literature from other regions and I finally found something. Mentions of the sword Pokemon Zacian and the shield Pokemon Zamazenta. The writing said that these two Pokemon were born somewhere beyond the slumbering wield. Sometime long, long ago. Did they really? Ta, Sonia. Thanks for digging into it. Even if it really isn't just an illusion or whatever, we did manage to find that Pokemon again. Maybe the sword and the shield that those used to carry are still here too. So I have to look for their item then, I guess. Zacian and Zamazenta. They maybe have been sleeping in the slumbering wheel right next to our hometown all this time. That's... That's why no one's ever entered the deepest parts of the woods for so long. I think I'm gonna end this episode here just because it's getting a bit late on it. If you like this video, like and subscribe, hit the bell icon or put some comments in the comments below. Uh, and look forward to the next video. And with that, Zerpify out.